What's going on, guys? It's your girl, Godly. Now, I know by now you've read multiple articles, seen many, many videos about the new Call of Duty, the next Call of Duty. Is it going to be MW4? Is it going to be Black Ops 3? Or is it going to be Ghost 2? As of right now, completely up in the air. Of course, you won't know anything until the spring, maybe even summer. But on some of the research that I did and some of the articles that I read, most of it is leaning to Black Ops 3. Now, through all of this, I kind of found a lot of things very interesting. Um, one of the biggest things that I read is that the new Call of Duties, the newest Call of Duties, quote unquote, have been losing quality. Now, I know for me, I haven't thoroughly enjoyed a Call of Duty since MW2. Wasn't a big fan of Black Ops, Black Ops 2, Ghost, definitely not. Um, MW3, wasn't that bad. So, as of right now, it'll either be MW4 by Sledgehammer. Now, Sledgehammer is, they're the ones who did MW3. So, it's either going to be MW4, Sledgehammer, or it's going to be Treyarch, Black Ops 3, or it's going to be Ghost 2. <clears throat> now, I can't imagine having a, a, another Black Ops like Black Ops 2. I literally about drove myself insane with that with that game. It just, there was no part to me that was absolutely appealing. You know, from the broken cameras to the lag, um, to David Vondahar, I just literally hated the game. It, the whole thing was a bad experience. Now, Call of Duty Ghosts, I don't have as many complaints, but I am thoroughly bored. Like, I'm just bored. The maps, um, you know, just little things, but all in all, like, it wasn't a broken game. It's not a broken game like Black Ops 2. But, you know, MW3, a lot of people didn't like that, you know, but I, I liked it. I mean, all in all, compared to the other games, um, you know, it wasn't that bad. But I found that interesting that, you know, it's not just me, that most of the community feel like that Call of Duty is losing their quality. Now, with Call of Duty Ghost, I found it to be interesting because I felt like they had the platform. Um, you know, it's Call of Duty Ghost is one of the biggest games on Xbox, and they could have made a killing, especially with the next-gen consoles. And I really feel like they didn't use that to their advantage. So anyway, as I'm reading on, doing some of this research, it talks about Call of Duty Ghost didn't utilize, you know, the or didn't utilize the full capabilities of the next-gen consoles, which I completely agree. There's not that much difference between the 360 and the Xbox One as far as graphics and as far as Call of Duty Ghosts. Now, we all know, you know, Xbox One, PS4, completely different console. But as far as the gaming, it just wasn't that different. So anyways, I go on further to read that James C. Burns, most of y'all know him as the voiceover for Sergeant Frank Woods. He's one of the primary characters in uh, Black Ops. Anyways, apparently he has his own Twitter, which is, you know, go figure. But he tweeted out the other day, last week, on the 26th of January, he tweeted out, hashtag Black Ops 3, hashtag Next Cod. Oh, what will tomorrow bring? Well, let me tell you this. If Treyarch has anything to do with tomorrow, I don't want to be a part of it. I am not a big fan of Treyarch. I didn't like World at War. I didn't like Black Ops. And absolutely, unequivocally, could not stand Black Ops 2. I'm not a big David Vondahar fan. I just, the whole experience, like literally, the game sucked. You know, and it's funny now looking at it that people are complaining about Call of Duty Ghosts, where, you know, they're complaining the same way that I did on Black Ops 2. So it's just kind of funny, you know, looking at it and seeing individuals do that. But like I said, if Treyarch has anything to do with it, like, I don't want any part to do with it. I told myself last time that if Treyarch was to make another game, I would never buy another Treyarch game. My experience from the lag to the broken cameras to David Vondahar to anything and everything in between completely sucked. Um... I just don't want anything to do with Treyarch. So I'm hoping that Sledgehammer gets it. I think they did a pretty good job with MW, uh, with MW3. Like I said, I'm not a big Treyarch fan. And Ghost 2, like I can't imagine um, a sequel to Ghost. Like, what are you going to do with it? And make the maps bigger and make it more boring? I don't really know. So anyways, this is just some of the stuff that I read and found out. I wanted to kind of share with you guys you know, um, get your thoughts, your comments, your concerns, you know, what are you hoping happens? What are you looking for the next COD? You know, for me, I want it, you know, I want it to go back to the basics. I think that, that was one of the things, you know, one of the things that pulled me into Call of Duty Ghosts is, 
you know, back to the basics. And that is not what I got with Call of Duty Ghost. So I'm hoping that they do take it back to the basics. And I'm hoping that it is, you know, something along the lines of Call of Duty 4 or MW2 because, you know, I completely agree. The newest Call of Duties have been losing quality. So let me know what your thoughts are. Who are you wanting to make the game? Are you wanting Sledgehammer, Treyarch, or maybe Infinity Ward? I don't know. Let me know what your thoughts are. That's what I got for you guys. Till next time, peace out. Oh! Nice work, Ghost.